Do you mean? I'm wide awake. <laughs> <laughs> I got another daddy on the way. McDonald's is my family. Roses are red. Violets are blue. <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you can see, I'm joined here with my mum and my little brother Atticus and today we are going to be doing a McDonald's mukbang Big Mac edition. So very excitingly, at the moment, the Big Mac sauce has been released at McDonald's. You can get it in these little pots and you can also get it in the limited edition bottles and they only made 500 of these bottles and the other day I got a knock at the door and it was the parcel guy, he gave me this brown box and it had a McDonald's M on it and I was like, oh my god. God, like what have they sent me and i opened it and inside was this box and it says on it hashtag mac it better big mac special sauce 2020 vintage bottle number 290 and i was like oh my god i've been sent a bottle of the big mac sauce now please correct me if i'm wrong i haven't seen anyone else be sent one of these bottles like if you've seen someone be sent one please comment down below but thank you so much mcdonald's because obviously you guys know mcdonald's is literally our life i haven't actually tried the big mac sauce yet so it's gonna be my first time trying it i'm actually not gonna have it out of the bottle because i want to keep this forever and that's why i've got a little pot of it here but yeah thank you so much mcdonald's this mukbang is dedicated to you i hope you guys enjoy if you do please smash a huge thumbs up and other than that, let's get started. So we've already had quite a few disasters with this <laughs> McDonald's. We literally the unbagged it, it the chips. I honestly wish I had the camera recording. <laughs> First of all, the chips just went absolutely flying my across my, my car. Chips. Yeah, mum's chips. And then we picked them all up and she didn't want to eat the ones off the floor, like understandably. So I gave her half of mine because I ordered a large. She then drops the whole portion of new chips that I've just given her. And then um, the chips went flying like the serviettes. When did the serviettes go flying? Yeah. Couple of years ago. Mm. Oh, memories. I've got my big prank sauce. So I'm going to try it. Have you tried some yours yet? Yeah, gorgeous. It smells really, really nice. Obviously, I've tried it in a burger, but I've just never tried it as like a dipping sauce. Do you want to try some Atticus? No, thank you. It's really nice as a dipping sauce. That's really nice as a mm. dipping sauce. Oh my god. It's really thick though. It kind of just tastes like, you know, mayonnaise and ketchup. Yeah. Mixed together. When I just had some of mine, I got the taste of sandwich spread i don't know if i've ever tried sandwich spread do you know what sandwich spread is is it literally called that comment down below if you know sandwich spread and it's sort of got that type of taste to it but with some tomato sauce and a little bit of mayonnaise thrown in what it does mm. taste a bit like sandwich spread lots of other are good with it it really does really no try one of them, of them would you like to try one you what? quite liked it the other night, mozzarella dipper, didn't you? I'll think about it if you say a big one. Mmm. This is unbelievable. Mm. I still can't believe so. We've been sent one of these bottles because we were just Googling, weren't we? One of the bottles is already on sale on eBay for £10,000. And one of these limited edition bottles back in, it was either 2010 or 2016, went for 65000 Oh, we're not be selling it. We're not be using it. It's going to sit there and mum's, <laughs> mum was holding it and going, it's a new car. <laughs> It is, but I also just feel super blessed to be sent one by McDonald's that I just don't want to get rid of it. Like, I just want to save it forever. So it's the one of I can on understand eBay. that. I do understand mm. you wanting to, like, keep it forever and all of that. I thought Amazon was the most expensive. Amazon? Yeah. Amazon more expensive than then eBay. Oh, right. Not necessarily. And some people are selling bottles of this for 3000 Mmm. Three thousand pounds. A lot of money. I personally, if it was mine, um, I would sell it because to me that is a new car, and I've got to get a new car. So I couldn't justify having because... a pot of sauce on the shelf, which is going to go off. So once it's gone off, it would probably wouldn't be worth as much anyway, because uh, the special sauce has a very short shelf These life. These have got seven days, and the bottle's got two weeks. But obviously, it's Anna's. It's not mine. So I can understand Anna treasure in it, the crown jewels. Oh, I've just it in my office already. <laughs> in my home yeah. office at home, it's got a little place on my desk because it means that much to me that McDonald's sent me one. I think that's pretty crazy that McDonald's sent me one. Mm, I can understand that, so. We've got a bunch of questions that you guys asked us on Instagram that we're gonna answer whilst we do this. So what do you all hope to achieve in the next five years? That's a really good question, I like that. You go first. I'll let you go first. Oh, okay. In the next five years, I hope to, if we're talking about YouTube goals, I'd love to have my own clothing line with the brand. Pretty little thing is like my ultimate goal to have a clothing line with. I would love just to carry on the way it's going. And in five years, hopefully I wanna own a house and basically hopefully just be more mainstream TV. So I've done like, maybe like a TV show would be really cool. I want to present something that'd be really cool um, and also just to be healthy 
as well. Well, Healthy I and would happy. want to go. What would you want to do? I would have went to been to Disneyland three times. That's good. That's a good one. Nice. That's a good one. Yeah. Disneyland or Disney World? I've just said four times. Why each? Right. Two in Disneyland and two in Disney World. Yeah. Yes, yeah, good idea, Atticus. I'm sure in the next five years, I imagine, we'd go once. So, Mum, what's your goals well, for the next five years? Still be breathing. Well, yeah. As you get older, you do think about your health and that more. And to be healthy, for the children to be healthy and happy. And just, yeah, it's survive, really. I'd like to be married. Wow, I've got another daddy on the way. <laughs> with a man that I really love and who really loves me. I've got another I daddy on the way. <laughs> no. No, darling. No, there's no, no. Mummy's just saying that probably in five years' time when you're a bit older and Mummy would probably like to meet a nice man, wouldn't I? That I can go out to dinner with and things like that, yeah? Who will be babysitting me? Me? Anna. Anna. Got to be in a really good job. Well, hopefully you'll be working in... I wonder what's going to come up. Yeah, go on, I Hopefully you'll be working with Amazon. <laughs> be paid on a lot of money. In Amazon? That's a new one. I've never heard him say that before. That'll be a pretty penny. <laughs> what, the Amazon warehouse? Oh, okay. There's one at Milton Keynes. Who's driving the car? Mum. I want a bit of uh, the burger, um... The role? Yeah. And in five years' time, I'd love to be a bit more travelled. I'd love to have gone to more cultural places, because I've gone to quite, like... Do you know what yeah. I mean? I've been to a couple of cultural places, but, like, where Dad is at the moment, and he's in, like, Thailand, Thailand and Bangkok. Yeah, it looks lovely. I'd love to go there and experience the culture and do everything, like, what Dad's doing. I'd love to do that. Mm, I agree what, with that Dad? One. Yeah, what, my Dad. What one? So funny. What Dad? I mean... Did you, you know, just say what one? There's not ten. There's two. There's two Dads, isn't there? There's Anastasia's and yours. Yeah. I mean, dad? what was it? Anna's, Anna's dad. Oh, I mean, God. her stepdad or her new. <laughs> my stepdad. Steve. Yes. By the way, if you wanted to know, <laughs> Mummy, roses are red, violets are blue. <laughs> Mummy went to the McDonald's, but then she needed a poo poo. <laughs> 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 Anna, keep, Anna, keep that in. Roses are red, violets are blue. Mummy drank a lot of water, and then she needed a wee wee. <laughs> Roses are red, violets are blue. I can smell a funny smell, <laughs> and it's you. I'm quite good actually for one off the bat. Right, next question. Are you going on holiday anywhere soon? So whilst you guys are watching this video, I will actually be in Geneva. I'm going skiing with Saf and her family, which I'm really excited for, because I've always wanted to go on a ski holiday. But I don't think it's something that you'd want to do, is it? Uh -huh. Not really. Where is the next place that you want to go on holiday? Um, my... <laughs> um, I would like okay. to go to Disneyland. He loved Disneyland, didn't well, yeah. he? Um, Where would you... Why would your dream holiday be? Dream holiday, I don't know, Atticus, but I'd probably this year I'd like to go to Turkey. Oh, Never been to Turkey. Could I go? Yeah, of course you could. Wouldn't well, you want to go back to Ibiza? Oh yeah. Yeah. It costs millions of but... pounds. It doesn't cost millions. It does. Ibiza's a lot more expensive than you think, actually. No, it's flights are cheap, but hotels yeah, are expensive. Yeah, flights are cheap, but um... you can get flights for like sixty quid, but then hotels are like yeah, in Ibiza. Yeah, uh, yeah. What's three things that you would tell your younger self that may have helped you? Oh my god. <laughs> Oh god, that takes a bit of thinking though. I would have told myself to Mom, not worry as much. Mum, when you were when you were about twenty eight. I would have told myself that I think the same as you, don't worry, everything will be okay in the end. What? Because mm -hmm. everything it always is okay in the end. I would have told myself to not care as much what people thought of me. Yeah. Because that ruined me in school. Mm. I don't have a younger self. No, because you're still young. I'm only five. I'm nearly six. What have you done, Mum? Mum, know that that sauce? Mm. It looks like skin. <laughs> Skin. He always goes funny when he stands there, doesn't he? Have you noticed? <laughs> Have you noticed that? You always like you it all yours, didn't you? Not worry, everything will be absolutely fine. I would have like said to my younger self, like you know, you'll have a great life. Everything will be fine. <laughs> Basically, you would have told yourself everything will be alright. <laughs> well, if anyone wanted that to know, um, but that's the only thing I can think of. If anyone mm. did, because let's face it, isn't anyone, that what you want to know that everything's going to be okay? Yes. Did something on you? It does a bit. I've only had one. It's, a, it's okay, darling. Um, I just hurt my finger on a water bottle. <laughs> Worst date you've ever been on? Oh, God. No, because I haven't really had any bad dates. Yeah, but I've got, like, to, I've got to look back. Okay, well, none of my dates have really, like, been horrific. Like, nothing's ever worked out from them, but... 
they've never been bad what's your no. worst date no i'm trying to think i don't think i've ever really had a no i feel like you would have <laughs> why because you've been on a lot more dates than me in your time mcdonald's is my family <laughs> I think it's gone funny again, look, look. Do you remember that time you went on a date to the pub at the bottom of our road? And oh, that was quite funny, yeah. yeah. And you got back and you couldn't get in the house because mm. the front door was broken mm. or you were quite drunk and you couldn't unlock the door or something. Oh, the door was broken. The door was broken and it was me, my friend and her mum and you couldn't get in so we had to like... Climbed through the window, didn't I? We but then you sent everything on the windowsill flying in the house and you blamed it on Amir. Did I? Yeah, you went, Amir, why did you do that? And she was going, do you? I was really drunk, I know. Do you remember? And then you, then finally Lisa opened the door straight away <laughs> i'd phone the estate agents you're phoning at like 1 a.m on the phone drunk and then we opened the front door yeah. at like one and that was quite mm. funny yeah. but that wasn't like a failed date though but now my house is my family <laughs> Yeah, so I haven't really had like, no, I haven't had like bad dates as such. You know, no, no, nothing's like worked out like forever, but then nothing really does anything work well, out forever really anyway. Who's yeah, your favourite? Some people, Mum. Your favourite singer. My favourite singer? Mine is Drake. Mm. I'm really loving Lewis Capaldi at the minute. I like his mm. new one. So do you, Attica? Before you go, I think that's um, a really cool song. Well. Do you want me to tell them who yours is? No, you're, you tell yours. Oh, I, I love Katy Perry too. Oh, no, Atticus loves Katy Perry. That's his favourite. He really likes Katy Perry. Yeah. He really wants to see Katy Perry. He wants to meet her, Anna. I, that's quite out of my reach. Yeah. I don't think I'll be able to make that happen. I can't believe how many followers she's got on Yeah, Instagram. she's one of the most followed people. I told him she stayed in the Disney castle, didn't she, Katy yeah. Perry? Yeah. Not many people. You only can stay in the Disney castle if you're invited. We're on about like the main castle. Like the main in the castle the, in the park. There's and like she was a, invited. Well, there's a suite in there's there. There's a suite in she, the castle. Yeah, she was very lucky. And you like watching the war video? Can you sing a little bit of it? <laughs> Go on then. What uh oh? What uh, 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 uh. Or Firework, bo Bon yeah. Appetit, that new one. Do you know that it? one? Bon Appetit, baby. I like Beyonce as well, actually. Queen Bee. Well, back in the day, her songs used to be better. Well, I'd love to see you pop out some well, songs and then do a two hour headline. Well, if itself. you wanted to know, well. Oh, he likes some um, because I'm happy. Grab along if you feel like a ruin. Don't you? You like that one? Well, do you know who my favourite character was to meet at Disney? Mickey! You love Mickey, didn't you? Okay, I've got another, I've got another question. What? If you could be any supernatural character, which one would you be and why? What one, Mum? Supernatural? So I'm talking like a mermaid or Bigfoot or a supernatural character that like, might not necessarily Mickey? exist. Mickey? I'm fictional. Mm, yeah, okay, fictional character. Supernatural is spirit, like spirit, supernatural. I don't think they mean that, do well, they? Well, mine would be. Well, they've heard. What does it mean? What type of supernatural what creature would, would you choose to what be? What is it? Hello? What does it mean? We're going to go off creatures like the Loch Ness Monster, a mermaid, Bigfoot. That's a weird question, eh? I think that's a fun question. Which one would we want to be? And why? I'd be Ursula. You'd like to be Ursula, would you? Mine would be a mermaid because I would love to be able to talk to the sea animals. No, actually, I know who mine would be, Mickey. You'd like to be Mickey, why? But that's not one of the options. Because I really like Mickey and but you can keep this in it if you want. He's my favourite Disney character. I guess that wasn't an option, but okay. What's something you used to think was cool when you were younger but don't anymore? Because oh, I know something. So many things. When I was younger. I know mine. Did you remember when I was younger and I used to beg you to buy me the chocolate cigarettes because I wanted to copy yeah, you? Yeah, yeah. The sweetie cigarettes. <laughs> no, they were chocolate. They were chocolate rolls and you could only get them from that corner shop, AM to PM. I know. AM to PM. Anna. What song is that? It's a song, isn't it? Christina Emiliano. Oh. <laughs> Anna, you just stink of you onion. Thank you. By oh. the way, she just... They were like chocolate rolls she... and you could get the like, lighters as well and I'd literally she stand outside. You could get the lighter? She yeah, smelled... you could get the lighters she and i stand outside disgusting. at seven years. What, the sweet lighters? She smells disgusting. <sighs> I remember when I used to stand outside at like seven years old and I'd have my chocolate cigarette in one hand. I'd be like lighting it up like you would. I don't remember them at all. I remember the sweet, chocolate I remember the candy sticks. Yeah. I remember the candy sticks, but no, they actually used to I don't remember chocolate cigarettes yeah. at all. But they don't have them anymore. No, you can't buy them anymore, I don't think. What did Something you... I thought was cool. No, you younger. don't. I was just thinking like when I was like 15, 16, there used to be a group. If you're of a certain age watching this, you'll remember it. There used to be a group called Soul to Soul. You used to dress a certain way and there used to be a Soul to Soul like website where you could get their merch from. <laughs> All that people. Can you imagine me walking around right now? I used to wear these big flares. Big Soul to Soul t All that I used to have the African oh. map on a neck. All that I want. Back to life. <laughs> Back to reality. 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 Back to re
Bye. And I used to order all the merch from the Soul to Soul website. So you don't think that's very cool anymore? No. no. All that I really want to talk about is Katy Perry. I know, you love we'll Katy Perry. We'll talk about Perry, Katy Perry then. You? Sing us a song. Well, I like that one where you think, I'm wide awake. <laughs> What do you mean? Yeah, that? she sings that song, doesn't she? I'm wide awake. <laughs> she does. <laughs> yes, you she know, does. you just put on this accent, like when you sing. Do you I? get this twang on your voice, and it's so strange. Uh, oh, what do you like, mean? I'm wide awake. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, why are you saying like that? Just go, I'm wide awake. <laughs> Say it again. Say it again. Uh, <laughs> wide awake. <laughs> you know you're gonna do All right, it. Hang well. on, no, I'll do it without doing it. Then. <laughs> 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 the words. I'm wide awake. My, what's your favourite song of Katy Perry, Anna? Bon Appetit. Okay. Attica sings Lewis Capaldi when no one's listening. He knows all the words to um. We like okay, you, yours think. is Lewis Capaldi. Mine is Katy Perry. Yeah. Katy Perry is the best music <laughs> star. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please smash a huge thumbs up. And, and other than that, that, I will see you very soon for a brand new video. <laughs> Bye. Bye.